So now let's talk about liquid liquid um equilibrium and what is this um all about. So um example if you have two liquids which are partially miscible with each other and then when you try to put it put them in a one container and then you'll so you'll notice that um because they are just partially miscible they, they did not really mix totally mix you will see two uh, phases coexist and these are the phases of the two liquids so this is where the um the concept of liquid equilibrium um uh, happens so um in the liquid liquid equilibrium we are given with the um three types of constant pressure liquid liquid solubility diagram which describes um different um different uh system for a different um temperatures or um compositions so for a constant pressure or the pressure is negligible or there is no effect of the pressure this uh, we can actually use this solubility diagram for us to uh, to look at the phases of or what happens if we increase or decrease the temperature and what happens the solubility of the two liquids using this solubility diagram so from the figure a that figure a shows uh, the binodal curves uh the condition where uh, the distinct phases uh coexist so this curve ual and ubl these are the <clears throat> the represent the compositions of the um coexisting phases this ual this is the alpha phase so if you have example your you are in this in this uh, uh location you will have a the alpha phase and the ubl is the beta phase um and what is this uh, broken line this broken line is the equilibrium compositions that defined by the intersections of the horizontal tie line with the binodal curves. These are the binodal curves. Binodal curves, this is our, this point A and point B are the also the inflection points. Where inflection points where the uh, curvature uh, starts to change its sign. So at each temperature, at each temperature of this um, point, these compositions are those for which also the curvature of the delta G versus the composition. So when we all know that at equilibrium delta G is zero. So at this also at this at this um, point, the delta G versus the x one also changes its sign starts because this is the inflection point. When you have a concave down, you will have a negative second derivative. And if you have a concave up, concave up, you also have a positive one. So let's look at letter uh, figure B, which is we have T U. T U is this the upper critical uh, solution temperature or the uh, the upper critical temperature. And T L is the lower critical temperature or lower critical solution temperature so between the temper between this temperature you uh liquid equilibrium is also possible For example if you have a temperature in this example um uh in this point i mean in this curve you will have a a composition here at, at this temperature and you will also have a um, another composition here in the beta phase. You will draw a tie line that will intersect this binodal curve, and this is your um, equilibrium compositions. So you'll have also a liquid equilibrium in this uh, condition. And, and as you can see here in Figure P, as you go um, higher and higher, example here. Ha uh, wait, yeah, 
as you go higher and higher until you reach the limiting states of the two phase equilibrium. <clears throat> the properties of this two phase equilibrium are identical. Since since you you already reach the uh the maximum point, you can say if it is in the alpha phase or in the beta phase, since they are already in the they call this the solubility increases. So they are soluble, so they are uh, already mixed with each other. And the same with if you um uh, decrease your temperature. If you decrease your temperature, you'll notice if you go down if you go down, you, you can still use your, uh, you can still intersect, you can use, you can still uh, draw a, a tie line <clears throat> intersecting between the two compositions. And as you go uh, lo uh, lower and lower until you reach the limiting states of the two phase, of the phase equilibrium, you will reach the um, lower uh, critical temperature. You, the properties is also, uh, identical for the two-phase equilibrium <clears throat> just the same for if you um, increase or decrease the temperature the solubility uh, the solubility of increases and the and the two-phase equilibrium will be identical so uh, but this figure a is um, a rarely observed it's not really that common so, but when they when they intersect at the freezing curve, as you can see in Figure B, only this um, upper critical uh, solution temperature exists, and um, also the same with the Figure C when they intersect the when they intersect at the um, vapor liquid equilibrium bubble point curve, only the uh, lower critical. Uh, solution temperature exist so uh and that's it that's what is um all about liquid liquid equilibrium <clears throat>